This is Moritz Escher, Dutch artist. What his eyes sees, his hands draw, is meant for your eyes. Look. Look carefully, please.
Fritz Escher, born in 1898. I hated school. The only class I liked at all was art. That doesn't mean I was any good at it, even at drawing. His parents want him to be an architect. His art teacher does not agree. Escher becomes an artist. Even today, that teacher is present in his studio. From the very first, he plays with space and man's perception of it. And he puzzles together images that interlock and sometimes mirror each other. In the beginning, he travels. He draws what he sees, fascinated by some landscapes and by architecture. But then, gradually, he begins to play his own game. Illusions and illusions within illusions. Whatever turn of fancy he follows, there is an inescapable logic and a strong preference for geometrical forms. Yeah, where does that come from? The laws of nature, they just amaze me. A sphere or a cube, they're beautiful. They still aren't personal, but you can make them more complicated more intense. And that's what he does with infinite patience to be looked at, touched, experienced. But Escher's world is that of an artist. His work that of a craftsman. This name, artist, I've always been very suspicious about it. I don't actually know what it means. I don't even know what art is. I do know what science is, but I'm no scientist. I must admit, not a single work ever succeeds. They all miss. Naturally. Because it's the dream I try for that can't be realized. shapes, converting, metamorphosing, endless cycles, suggesting movement. If I 
I had a second life, I would certainly be busy with cartoon films. The Wheel Weevil was created out of my own amazement that nature hadn't invented the wheel. I find it extremely difficult to accept the fact that nature didn't take care of that. Nature also does not provide for water that flows upwards. This print is based on a drawing by the English mathematician Penrose. As a drawing, it is perfectly all right, but it is really impossible. I use the triangle three times in this print. That is why the towers appear to be the same height, even though one is a story lower than the other. Escher, who says he doesn't know what art is. He doesn't know the first thing about mathematics. Still bases much of his work on science. To his surprise, scientists have often found his work the only visual way of presenting their theories. Ja, dat uh, dat dat waardeer ik zeer en de de esthetiek die loop ik eigenlijk helemaal naast. Yeah, I appreciate that very much, but as for uh, aesthetics, oh the hell with that. <laughs> <laughs>